tanghali po, Master Chef Kramenis, on the go. Balay, 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 bika nga, para naman may pakita namin sa inyo, gagawa tayo ng sopas. Ngayon yung ating po sopas, ika nga ay chicken soup with, sabi niya, elbow noodles. Ngayon, ano po ba ating mga sangkap dyan? San Sandamukal. Isang ulo ng bawang na ating pong tinadtad, ay ito po yung ating mga sangkap, bika nga. So, ayan po yung ating mga sangkap. Ayan, huwag ka nga yung celery. Ito po ay uh, nag-mix, naghalo ika nga ng uh, sibuyas bumbay at sibuyas americano. Okay po. Meron tayong nilislice na longjit, eh, panghaba, pahaba na ating carrots. Baga maglalagay din po tayo ng mixed vegetable. Ayan po yung ating chicken breast. Pinainit po natin ang ating pong uh, uh, bracer pan. Bakit bracer pan? Kasi po yung isa nating... Uh, 10 quarts, ika nga, ay ating pong uh, divinigay. Ipinadala natin doon sa isa nating uh, kabarangay. Eh, hindi ko nakita doon sa pinakita niyang niya pinakita doon sa <laughs> pagboklat niya ng kanyang mga box. Ika nga, wala hong nakalagay. Pati sa patos din natin nakita. However, ika nga, gano'n lang talaga. So, ating pong ikakaramilize ang ating pong bawang nilagyan po natin ng kaunting lalagyan din po natin ito ng cabbage mamaya po slice natin ng pahaba so marami na tayong nilagay na garlic para po masarap yung ating pong sopas so yung sopas po natin ni Kanga sopas na boys ko tawagin <laughs> masaysa na lumalagotok lumalaga pa kasi nilagay po natin yung ating pong ha uh, uh, huh? Ayan po, para naman din hindi po mahirapan si Master Chef Carmen dahil nahihirapan po eh. Nahihirapan po sa ating pong sitwasyon. Okay, so yan po yung ating pong inilagay ito nga na stand. Na hindi masyadong makita. Uh, pwede yun lang natin ipa. Ayan po yung ating pong. Ayan po, nilagyan natin ng medium yung ating heat. Okay, kakaramelize po natin ito. Nilagyan po natin siya ng 1 tablespoon na 1 tablespoon po na butter na dyan po sa ating sopas. Ngayon po, pakita po natin sa inyo mamaya uh, para sa, sa iba po dyan na naghahanap ng ingredyente uh, siguro sa mga susunod na araw saka po natin yan may ayos. Hindi ko pa po alam kung paano kung maglagay doon sa ano. But anyways, lalagay po natin yan. Huwag uh, ko yung mag-alala. Kasi simula pa lang natin. Hindi pa tayo nagtatagal. So, let's just be patient. Ika nga. So, lagyan natin ng celery. Opo, meron pong carrot cheese po. Meron po tayong yung onions mamaya, opo. Meron din po tayong uh, stripe lang ika nga. We cut the breast, chicken breast na ang stripe ika pahaba. Now, ang ating pong uh, chicken breast, gawa nang wala naman siya maraming dugo, isa lang po ang hugas natin ika nga. Minsan na lang natin hinugasan, nilamas natin ng konti sa asin, pero wala naman po sa ika nga mga joints ika nga or mga maraming lipid para naman din magkaroon siya ng reaction. That's the reason why. Kani-kanya po tayo, ika nga. Kapag ka chicken breast, hindi natin. Malamig po, yes po. Mm -hmm. nag snow po sa labas. Mataas po yung snow kahapon at kagabi. Ayan po, nag snow na naman po. At ika nga ay uh, gusto ko sana lumabas para naman doon po sa ating pong may mga pagpremyo. Ngayon doon po sa mga nauna, ika nga. Maraming salamat sa Hugs from Wab dahil sila po ika nga ay na, naunang nakarilis ng... Uh, pa-premium nila. But anyway, hindi po tayo abutin ng isang taon. Uh, ito, ika nga, ako rin po ang gagawa niya. Gawa niya yung aking pong manunga ngayon nasa hospital uli. At uh, siya lang po ang aking inasahan na gagawa ng task na yun. But anyway, sabi niya, don't be sad. Let's be happy. Sabi niya nga, kailangan lang natin ng kaunting pasensya. Kailangan lang po maantay po niyo ng kaunting. Ako ang lalabas. Ako po ang lalabas para po dyan. Lalabas po tayo. Ako po ang lalabas yan. At uh, gagawin ko po yan. Kung uh, huminto po yung snow ngayon. Ngayon sana, kailan makapal po yung snow at malamig po talaga. Kaya hindi po natin, ano, hindi, hindi po, hindi po kayo gaya, hindi kayo gaya, gaya lumabas po.
Kaya, <laughs> masay chef po kayo, hindi ko kayo, hindi ko kayo nag-iisa. I am still here. Master Chef Carmen is once in a while medyo <laughs> napapalinga, napapatanga. But anyways, tuloy-tuloy ho tayo. So, atin po muna yung gagawin karamelize po natin. Let make, let's make it uh, a little bit golden yung ating pong uh, bawang. Kasi nga po, ang gagawin po natin ay so fast. Nasabihan na po ako na tanggalin ko daw yan. Sa susunod po, lilinisin po natin. Medyo mabigat lang po yung katawan ni Master Chef Carmen. Hindi niya po matanggal. Ipaglinis po ng aking lutuan. Hindi ko po mabitbit yun. At uh, mahirap po kasi yung bitbitin pa po sa iba ba. Sa iba ba ng pinatawag na cupboard natin. So, ayun po. At ating pong isusunod ang ating pong pagkaya na i-caramelize na brown na. Yan po. Susunod po natin ang ating pong sibuyas. Tapos yung ating pong, ating pong chicken breast. Yung breast po ng ating pong isa sa hog din sa ating sopas. Aking pong ibinigay, i-denonate ko po yung aking 10 quarts o po. So, Bagamat binuksan ng karton, hindi po nakita. Eh, well, sabi niya nga, in the days to come, siguro naman, eh, ilalagay din nila. But anyway, sabi niya, that doesn't matter, whatever. Kung yan, ikaw nga, nga um, maliit na bagay, ikaw nga, okay lang. So, lalagay na po natin ang ating kong... Ang onion po natin, ikaw nga, katulad ng sabi ko, nag... our onion has the white one, which we call, I am calling it uh, Americano, because it's a white onion, and what you call the Bombay, the Indian one, the red one, we call it Bombay in Tagalog or in Filipino language. Now, we will put the, we'll put this one, uh, that's the chicken. put our mushroom oyster sauce. We're gonna put our carrots and the celery. Let's put the cover and put a little amount of black pepper. Just a little bit. Yes, of course, we're going to put our mixed vegetables. And we cover it and simmer it there. And we'll be back and show you what's next. Meanwhile, we just make it uh, simmer while we're sauteing it. So we saute those things and we'll just wait until it in five minutes when the vapor ball click, click, click. Always remember, Salad Master has a vapor bulb. This is the vapor bulb, that's what we call it. Now, if it will click, 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 then I'm going to adjust. I'll be back and I'll put the vegetables. All right? Be back. Hello! So, we will put the elbow. Now, we're going to go deep, straight there. Yes, of course. That's the beauty of my equipment. We put this one.
yes you don't separate boil it no we just uh, dump there and we put water and we simmer until it's cooked I think that's really more than enough. We're gonna be sauteing and put it there. No, there's no water yet. Yes, that's how I do it. Yep. We included it in sauteing it, yes. That's what it is. Yep. And then we're gonna put water. Water that I'm gonna be putting is the boiling water that boils this while ago. Yeah, I put the one that's already been boiled, I put it in. We, we did not uh, separate the boiled uh, pasta. Yeah, we do it, put it there together. Yes, I did. We put it together and uh, I'll boil again. So that's, I'm going to put the cover and let me just put this on. Put the cover. We just put small amount of salt. That's the salt I put. Yes, we don't want a salty soup. It is just going to adjust. So if you want to adjust it, you will be adjusting it on your bowl. If you want a little bit of uh, fish sauce, you can do that. But for me, I am not uh, putting high taste inside the uh, equipment or while it's cooking so it's up to you to adjust if you adjust if you're going to adjust it with a little amount of um, uh, pepper so that it will be a little bit uh, hot the choice is yours so every time i do it i want it to be blended like uh, for instance if there are kids who wants to eat it so children will not be avoiding it because it's not too hot it's not too salty just good enough and it's the uh, adult will be the one to adjust I am not putting a high level taste in there. I am always putting it a little bit lower. That is supposed to be because of the kids and because of the children or infant. So even a toddler can zip the soup. The soup is so good, okay? I'm going to I'm going to harvest my young onion in my garden I'll show you my garden <laughs> remember I had my spinach a friend of mine gave a bunch of spinach and that is from the garden well maybe you want to look at it outside see the snow it is snowing the drop of the snow is like a flake so it's on the ground, as you can see, uh, the snow on the ground. And uh, um, that's why I really want to share with you. So here is my garden. And those are my plants. Last seven months ago, as you can see it in my, uh, in my uh, uh, mushroom, how it is. This is where the mushroom grows. And this. So that's the reason why I have my head over there. So that's my garden. I'm gonna harvest this one and put it in my soup later on. And uh, I am really encouraging you to put fortune plant. Oregano. And try to accommodate yourself by planting any kind of flowers or anything that you are 
um, so that it keep you keep you busy. So here's the other fortune. So keep yourself busy and make yourself accommodate yourself with with your uh, with your with your garden. Yeah. Why not? Chocolate, hazelnut, peanut, cashew nuts. <laughs> Always have your life uh, back to back, elbow to elbow. Make it. Uh, I well, I. Do you think I, I don't have pain? I still have pain in there, yes, indeed. Because I am now almost uh, uh, two hours standing and cleaning and chopping and everything. So I can feel it's tingling. So I need to give it a break for that one. Anyway, so here is our soup. We'll see. So it's boiling. Yes, indeed. It's boiling. We're going to add it up with with our water in here yes i will add it up because we are creating soup by the way we are we are cooking soup let me just put the vegetable so here's the veggies I make a lot yes I make a lot because if somebody will come at least at least we we can share hmm it's yummy yummy Let's cover it again. Cover it up and I'm gonna mix up with a homemade. This is a homemade noodles. Courtesy of, uh, I had a friend of mine who came here and gave me this. It's a homemade, they made it on their own. They have the slicer, they have, you know, they make their own spaghetti, they make their own noodles, and uh, that is homemade, that's what we call it, organic, because it's made at home. And uh, it is really good. It is really nice because homemade. <laughs> and above all, it's also free because they create it on their own and they share it to me. And uh, her name is Vanji. Vanji came over here about two months ago and she gave me also help. She gave me sabon or so for my uh, utensils. She gave me noodles, she gave me cooked food. And uh, that's uh, on my first uh, two or three weeks, I uh, got an accident. That's what, see, that's, that's what the last uh, one that uh, I'm gonna be using it for. All right, see you. Hi! <laughs> Are you scared because this is too big to cover my face? <laughs> anyway, I will show you because it click, click, clicks and sh we show you what's going on. So that's what's happening. Uh, we cover it. Let's cover it. I'm going to show you. I'll put small amount of cabbage. So this is the cabbage that I'm going to be putting. This is the noodle that I'm going to be mixing it up. And this is the mixed vegetable. Yes. Yes, indeed. I put mixed vegetable and uh, you know why? In order for the kids to have it and consume it. Children, if they are hungry in time of the day like this, it's also good. And afterwards, the last thing that you're going to put is the cream. It's a, a cream meal. Yes, you put this one. Absolutely. This is the last thing that you're going to dump it in when it's all done. Meaning, the pasta is already cooked. You put already the mixed vegetable. You put the cabbage. And this is the last evening, as what we say. So this is what we're gonna put at the end of our 
cooking. Uh, so you will enjoy and having had fun with that one. I want to make, I want to bake a banana bread, but uh, it looks like I am. Uh, I was not able to sleep last night. I, I don't know why. Sometimes it is really the adjustment of my. Um, it's not every day that uh, it's okay. Sometimes once once in every three days, I feel that I feel I, I feel that there's something. You know, I don't know where to put. I put it up. I put it somewhere else. But still, I couldn't sleep. So. <laughs> And that's the reason why I, I am really a little bit tired. Um, I really would want to go today, but then um, since the snow is really over, boy, well, it's not stopping. It's not stopping. It's it's coming like flakes, you know, and that's the reason why I said I better not go. Otherwise, they're gonna have a headache. Uh, I cannot cover it. I cannot use, I cannot wear uh, shoes or boots. And uh, if I will do that, that really gonna be ruining anything and everything because I'm not supposed to wear those with my leg like this or with my toe like that. So, but anyway, uh, I am boiling water because I want coffee in order for me to be awake, you know. <laughs> and uh, okay, it's a month, sorry. It, it's, it's a month, sorry. It's heart month. It's love. Love is lovelier on the second time around if there is somebody to be loved. Now, if you you cannot find the love, the true love is love God above all and love yourself. Now, one more thing that I would want to remind you for the boomers. We are the boomers that sometimes we are really stubborn in, in so many ways, uh, uh, being a boomer. Uh, one more thing that I would want to tell you. Are you gonna forgive somebody else who never asked forgiveness? I think you're just gonna be praying to the Lord. Now, if in case there are those home, or let's say your friends, never say sorry to what I did, would you forgive him or her? I think you need to, you must to. Because any time of the day, if you're gonna go and the Wi-Fi from uh, Lord Jesus is, God, is done, always remember karma never speaks. So you better do it on your own. For the benefit of your own, peaceful mind you forgive just say and talk to the lord and tell it to the lord and you whisper because even you whisper that you're the only one who could hear it there's the wind that blows that sometimes the dreams of tomorrow is the reality of today whatever your dream sometimes that makes into a hint that's the reason why you keep doing it but anyway let's talk about my cooking let's go back to how it is it's uh, boiling now it's not clicking but it moves and that's the reason why i look at it be back in a few minutes hi hi let the spirit high of course absolutely so now i'm gonna put the cabbage i'll dump the cabbage yep i'm going to dump the cabbage over there and i'm gonna put the mix of vegetables Is that really my soup? Oh yeah. Yes, indeed. I really would want to have the corn and the, you know. Well, we already had slices the carrots into a stripe, but then I really would want to put those things because that looks so nice and so lovely when you put it in a bowl. And the children are really attracted with different colors. And you will see, they're gonna pick one on one to have and eat it. And let's tear it. I want to bring up my 16 quarts, but I had difficulty in uh, taking them. Well, that's good enough. That's really good enough. And that's really nice. It's yummy. It is yummy. We put, we cut the chicken breast stripe so that uh, that's, uh, but thin. It is not thick, it is thin. It's only thin. I really would want to join the shrimp I don't know if they're gonna like it, but we'll see if I'm going to join and put the shrimp, or otherwise let's make another cuisine for the shrimp so that um, it won't be luxurious. You know, we had another cooking for tomorrow and we put the shrimp. So maybe you're gonna do the squash. We call it cream, 
you put coconut cream with squash and shrimp what do you think <laughs> tomorrow that's our menu oh anyway uh i'll show it to you once it happens so that's what happened to our and let's cover it again okay let's talk about yesterday yesterday today and tomorrow in my frustration before as i am uh, just sharing it to you at my age 17 it's a wrong age to fall in love why because that is just a puppy love you better think about it for the young ones or the old ones if you're about 20 26 don't think it's the time for you to do it be prepared if you had a chance to go to school finish university and get a degree because if you're a degree holder the better be you could and the better chance you have now if you are just gonna be running out because you want uh to think you really love this guy you really love this uh, girl think about it for the millennials if you had a chance to go to school mag-aral ka muna pakinggan mo ang iyong ina pakinggan mo ang iyong sarili ikaw ba ay talagang gusto nang magpakamot eh <laughs> bato bato sa langit ang tamaan wag magagalit wag ho kayong mapipikon ang pikon talo Binibigay lang natin sa inyo ang mga opportunity. If you are here in Canada and you had the opportunity to finish your studies and become a degree holder, grab the opportunity, my friend. It is not, I'm not saying it's not nice to fall in love, but if you are going to be falling in love and then you will be suffering because you did not finish your university where you're going to get the money when you become pregnant, what to do with the baby? Ha, 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 ha. Think about it today. If you have still chance, better grab the opportunity because opportunity will never come back. Whatever opportunity you have here today, you will bite your elbow. If you could bite your elbow, then you get all the good thing in life. But if you can't, sequences will be on your side and difficulty is in you. Okay, natikman mo yung sarap. Nanganak ka ng wala sa oras. Nagkaroon ka ngayon ng paghihirap. Bakit? Be, hindi kaya kaya. Kulang ang pambili ng ganito. Kulang ang pambili ng ganyan. Kaya na mo sisisihin yan. Sisihin mo ang iyong sarili. Sa, kasi binigyan ka ng opportunity. Hindi mo naman ito pinagbuti. Well, bakit ko na ba banggit ito? Para po ito ipaalala sa gamot sa tao nakakalimot. Kaya kayo nakakalimot dahil baliw ka sa pag-ibig ngayon. Iontog mo yung ulo mo sa unan, huwag sa pader. Para maintindihan mo ano, bakit nagtapik ng ganito si Master Chef Carmen? It's love month, ika nga. Araw na mga puso, isang buwan po yan hanggang Pebrero katapusan. Kung ano man ang kanyang katapusan, 20 so 29 ba? Wala naman tayong try sa katry tayo uno. And that's the reason why you better listen. Ang pagsisisi ay laging nasa huli ulit bago ka magsisi. Gawin mo muna ngayon ay kabubuti. Kasi ang mga bagay-bagay na para sa sinasabi ng mabuti ng iyong ina para sa iyo ay para sa magandang kinabukasan mo sa magiging anak mo. Ay ngayon, nursing mother ka na. Gusto mo mag-aral ng nurse. Gusto mo maging teacher. Gusto mo maging doktor. Paano mo yan gagawin? Inuna mo yung kate. Hello! <laughs> Bakit? Kasi dinanas ko po yun. I've been there. Is it funny? No. That's the reason why I am trying not to convince you, but to tell you I've been there. Gusto mo bang maging muchacha ka ng sarili mong pamilya? Okay lang yun. Pero yung kukulangin ka, ay kulang yung pambili ng ganito, papano. How you gonna stretch the money when not both are working? Working lang yung husband, tapos ikaw nakapadedy ka na kasi you need the milk for the baby. Eto ka, hindi mo natapos ang pinag-aralan mo, ano ngayon ang gagawin mo? Kagatin mo yung siko mo. But before it's too late, sa inyo na hindi pa nakapag-decision, okay, sabi na natin, naglabing-labing na kayo, nagsama-sama na kayo, pero habang wala pang anak, change your mind. Finish your career and be a professor and be a professional and be a, digni be a dignified, a professional one. Ano man ang gusto ng iyong uh, puso't isipan, 
nangungontra yan dahil ang pag-ibig ika nga ay natatalo. Always remember, mas mataas ang ulo kaysa sa puso. Kaya dapat ang ulo, ang utak, ang dapat sundin, ang puso dito lang sa baba. Now, it is uh, clicking. It clicking. It clicking. I thought that there is somebody else clicking outside. It clicking. We're gonna put the next one. Patalastas po yun. Araw ng mga puso, and that's the reason why pag-ibig na buhay, pag-ibig na patay, pag-ibig na bigo, pag-ibig na maligaya, at pag-ibig na tagumpay. Kaya ika nga, sa inyo po, huwag ko kayong magagalit, sapagkat Master Chef Carmen is just like your mother, your sister, your mom, your, your neighbor, who cares? I don't really care because I was there. Andyan po. If I'm gonna be looking back, I was only 17 when I graduated in high school. Do you think it's nice? I am not regretting. I have four beautiful girls. So, balit na tapat bagamat, you can only make what it can in that moment. Balik ko tayo in a few minutes sa ating pong so. Hi, hi, hi! I am back again because I did put the another noodles. Yan po, courtesy po yan ni Vanji. Banji Mara, that's uh, from you and uh, ikaw na salamat po ng marami. Balik ko tayo sa ating topic. Man, did I regret that I have four girls? No, I did not. However, lahat ho ng kahirapan ay aking dinanas. Meron ka bang dapat sisihin? Ah, eh, gusto mo kayang mga te. O, oh, diva? <laughs> Bato-bato sa langit, wag ko kayong magagalit. I hope you're not gonna be uh, cursing me because of what I said. I am just telling you the experience that I have in my life and that's the reason why if you had a chance to have you had a chance to explore and be professional and finish your university and become a doctor, a nurse a lawyer why not chocolate hazelnut peanut <laughs> cashew nut <laughs> so let me just uh, let me just do this one and as you could see, it's almost finished. Our soup is almost finished, but we're gonna add it up water because we want our soup to have a soup. We don't uh, we don't want a soup that is really a lot of soup. That's why we we want to do it. If I had seaweeds now, I put seaweeds. If I had seaweeds, because it's also nice if you're gonna put seaweeds in it. Let me just try it. Wow, that is just a miracle in my tongue. <laughs> like for instance now, you're almost finished with your career. A teacher, a nurse, a, uh, uh, a doctor. However, in the middle of your thing, you did something else. The temptation is between your legs, between your eyes, and between your, uh, your ears. And you made, you made a move. Now your career is hanging. If there is no mother to look and help you out, do you think you will progress? <laughs> Here in Toronto, Canada, you bite, a, you bite your elbow. You need money if you want a babysitter. You need money if you want to go further. You need money if you're gonna be buying a house and you need money if you will be renting your own place. That's the reason why. Huwag mong kalilimutan ng pagmamahal at paalala ng yung ina sa pagkatika nga ay walang pagdududa. Ang kanya pong pag-ibig ka nga ay tunay na kaibig-ibig dahil mahal ka niya. Bigyan mo at gantihan mo ng kagandahan ang iyong ina dahil siyam na buwan kanyang dala-dala. Pag ikaw ay naging ina rin, malalaman at malalaman mo. Subalit, kung wala na sa mundo ay yung ina, ano pa ang mangyari sa mundo mo? Kaya ika nga, huwag mag-atubili at huwag magpabaya. Kayo ika nga ay magsumikap para naman sa ikabubuti ng iyong sariling tahanan. Be back to you when it's ready. I'll show you what's the finished product, what I had uh, prepared. Anyway, 
I'm sorry somebody is ringing but I did not because I am talking to all of you. To all my viewers, I am really happy because I was been uh, designated here and I don't believe this is just a coincidentally. Always remember I am not very good with all the gadgets but I'm trying to do the best I could to learn out of it because if in case my daughter will become busy and she's not here, who's going to be editing it? And of course, I am saying thank you so much because with the collaboration of Hugs From Above, everything is okay. If you had any problem from before, like what I say, don't cling and live on to the past. Leave it behind you. There's a beautiful place. The world is so nice. Life is so good. Let's go to the next level and forgive and I shall be forgiven. And likewise... Master Chef, I'm to go. I'll show you when I'm gonna be eating my soup. Bye. Hi, I'm back. But now we're not gonna be giving a sermon or otherwise. We're just gonna be saying love, love, love. We spread love. So what we're gonna do now? It's done. We are going to put the cream, and I'm gonna eat now my lunch. Okay. Now take it off. Uh oh. Ay, 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 what happened? Yes. So this is the cream, and we're gonna put the cream in there. So this is now my soup. Ha, uh ha. -huh. Yes. This is what we call the a la Master Chef Carmen soup. That's the chicken breast soup with mixed vegetable. Wow, <laughs> it's, it's perfect. Oh la la. Now I'm going to put in my bowl and uh, that's the yummy, yummy thing of the soup that we did today. And uh, let me just put the cover and once it boils, once it boils, I put a little bit of uh, heat. It's only number four. I put it in number seven. Okay. And when it boils, I'll get myself a soup. I'm not going to be eating today a bread. Oh, yes, there is. I'm show you. Wait, I'll show you. Yes, this is the Insaimada. You're gonna eat it with Insaimada. And this is uh, made in Philippine, Filipino store. So it is really with um, Astripa. Oh yeah, it's a Filipino baker. It is really a Filipino baker who did this cheese Insaimada, Insaimada. So that's the delicacy in the Philippines. So if you're gonna have this one, this is also very yummy. So, I call already my uh, barangayan, ang ami po mga kabarangay. At sa inyo pong lahat, to all people who's watching, uh, have a happy, happy Valentine's. I love you all. And of course, I am going to be putting in my, in my bowl. Now, it's ready. It's ready. There you go. I give away my 10 quarts. I send it in the box. So, let me just have mine. Now, 
now it's up to you. So that's my lunch. And they say mother. It's up to you if you want. It's up to you if you want sliced bread, if you want something else. But me, this is just good enough for me. They'll put it off. And let the challenge begin. We cover it. And I'll get one for Ma, for me. And that is well be given for the gun. So this is the inside mother. Yes. FB Filipino <laughs> Filipino store. And this is my soup. Tarat and let's go. Master Chef out. Power off. I love you all. <laughs>